Hey guys, it's Brody here from Pacific Toyota. Just here to give you a quick virtual tour on the lovely Ford Ranger that you've inquired on with me today. Now, a little bit about our dealership here in Cairns before I jump into the video. This is one of our two pre-owned yards here. This one's located at 77 Mulgrave Road. The other one we've got's down at 235 Mulgrave Road. Now, next to our other yard, we also have Toyota brand new vehicles, Lexus of Cairns and all our service and parts as well. As you can see, we do have Toyota Finance available on all of our pre-owned cars. And that's just our showroom, just up the stairs there as well, where we do uh, most of our work with for the day. Otherwise, when we're out here on the yard, but. Without going too much further into us, I'll jump straight into the video tour. So I wanted to start straight under the bonnet here, get you a good look throughout the vehicle, interior, exterior, obviously under the bonnet and just a bit of the underbody through the wheel arches and stuff like that. But straight through there, all really, really clean. This beautiful uh, sort of yellowy orange color as well. Just quickly pop this bonnet down so we can have a look at everything through here. If there's any sort of stone chips, scratches, anything like that, I will point them out. But as you can see through there, just a bit of dust on there, but all really, really clean otherwise. Nothing I can point out. And obviously a great shape on these ranges as well. Just a bit of dirt on there. All right, obviously the bi turbo as well. So has a badge on the side, full tread on the tires there too. Goodyear tires, so a top quality tire. No gutter ash or anything in that genuine Ford alloy wheel as well. And to give you an idea, it's all really, really clean under the underbody as well. Coming through the front bar, you do have your front parking sensors throughout there. Um, so obviously if you're driving forward into anything, they will obviously beep if you get too close. You've got your updated front grille, LED headlights and fog lights down there. And then like I said, that updated grille that looks amazing on these ranges. Just a, I oh know, it's a bit of bug splatter, sorry. I thought it was a scratch, but that's all coming off with my nail. So no imperfections or anything as of yet. A very, very minor couple of stone chips on there that I wanted to point out. Obviously nothing major, but I want to be as honest as I can in this video for you. All the rest there, all really, really clean. Same thing on the front left-hand tire, full Goodyear, uh, good tread. No gutter ash or anything in that wheel there. Coming up through here, I do apologize. It is a fair bit dirty, just gets all the dust that comes off the, our main road here. But no cracks, chips, anything like that in the windscreen. We do all the roadworthies in-house as well, so um, you know it's all been roadworthy. Um, we give you car history reports, it just says it's never been written off, stolen, it doesn't know any other money or anything. Obviously has the genuine roof rails uh, on there as well from new. All nice and clean otherwise. I did just miss a bit of a stone chip here on this front left-hand guard. I don't know how I missed that, but I uh, just wanted to point it out for you anyway. It does have the cameras underneath the uh, mirrors as well. Up through the tops of the windows, they're all nice and clean. Through the passenger rear door, nothing I can point out there. And then through your driver's door, there's a couple of just very light little scratches in there that I wanted to point out, but otherwise all nice and clean. Obviously it has your keyless entry, so the keys are in my pocket. Um, I don't know if you heard it locked before, just when I touch that button there, but if you open it, you can unlock the car, and then to lock it up, you just press that button there and it locks the car. So obviously it's gonna keep unlocking because I've got the keys in my pocket, but I did just wanna let you know about that feature there as well. Fuel caps on the left-hand side for us. It does have that genuine side step in the side there that they have from brand new. It does have rear parking sensors, a tow bar, wiring harness already fit. So it is all ready to go. Heaps of tread in the back tires as well. No gutter rash on there either. And again, really, really clean under the underbody there. Full size spare tire as well. All right, coming through the back here. Rear tailgate looks all nice and clean. Just a bit of dust on there. Obviously you get your genuine reverse camera as well. All your wild track and four x four badges through there. Popping this one down, it does have a uh, plastic tub liner in there as well. So just protect the inside of this tub if you are throwing anything else in there or anything like that. It does have your genuine uh, tie down points in the tub there, as you can see. And obviously this automatic roller cover, you just press that button there on the side and it automatically opens up for us. So really easy to use. If you are gonna be storing anything in there, you can close that up and it'll lock it up. Um, stop anyone from peeping in the outside and then if you obviously need that extra space You can just leave that open and drive with it open as well Down the right hand side. It's all nice and clean Heaps of tread in that fourth and final wheel and again, no gutter ash or anything So all four wheels all really really tidy nice and clean through your back door here Nothing I can point out 
same as your driver's door, all really, really clean. Same as up through the top of the windows here. So just jumping into the back now for us. Obviously being the wild track, it has your leather interior. Nice and clean through that driver's side door card. Cup down here is all nice and tidy as well. Obviously you get your aircon vents in the back as well as USB and USB-C point there. All nice and clean through the leather as well. Obviously you get that orange little stitching for the wild track, but no rips, tears or anything like that in the leather. And all your roof linings all really, really clean as well. Back of the front seats are all nice and tidy too, so really easy in there. Jumping in the front here, obviously you have your blind spot monitoring and your mirrors there as well. Can't really see that there, but obviously just want to let you know about that feature as well. Mirror and window controls as well as your central locking on the driver's door card. And that uh, yellow stitching on the leather there for that wild track as well. It does have a front floor mat in there as well that I wanted to point out. Just needs a quick clean up, but automatic front seat as well. So you can adjust that with that there. And then obviously it's got that wild track stitching in the seats there as well, which they're both in great condition too, the seats. And then just has another front floor mat on that side. So all nice and clean in the left-hand door card there. I'll grab the keys out of my pocket and just give you a quick run down here. So you've got your two main keys, your main and your spare, sorry. Obviously, um, you've got that button on the key that you can also adjust the uh, the roller cover on the back with. So you just double click that and it closes it as well as opens it. So really cool feature on these on these wild tracks. All right, now into the interior, which these things are probably the most up to date in the Utes at the moment. Giving it a, a quick look through here, digital dash, all nice and clean. Obviously, no engine warning lights or anything like that. Uh, so on the kilometers there, uh, where are we here? So 40,461. Again, no engine warning lights or anything like that. All nice and clean through the steering wheel. Nothing I can really point out to you on that side. Got all your volume Bluetooth buttons through there, as well as your um, tune buttons and everything on that side. Your cruise control and everything's up here for you. Uh, come down here, all your lights. Obviously you've got a cup holder just sitting in there hidden as well. Nice up-to-date dash as well. All really, really clean as well as the wild track stitching on that side as well. Bit of extra storage through here, as well as that little pop-up part here. Gives you that another bit extra storage, as well as your glove box, which I'll go through the service history for you in a second. But coming up through here, huge screens in these, so it's all set up and ready to go. It's got your maps, uh, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, or your Bluetooth, everything through there. You can even control the air conditioning um, through the touch screen, as well as just on your fan speeds and everything just here. So really easy to use got a charging point in here as well as a usb and usb-c there um, obviously you got your automatic gear stick which gives you that nice reverse camera through there and then you can see that 360 view from those cameras underneath there as well as your parking sensors um, that'll pop up on the front and the rear here when you are a bit closer to something you can see i'm a bit closer to that pole so it does just let you know just highlighting a green at the moment and it'll start flashing a bit more as you get closer all your four-wheel drive modes and everything through here. Automatic park brake as well, so really easy to use. Center console is all really clean as well. Last thing I'll go through is just your service history, just to show um, how well the car's been maintained and everything like that. So coming through here, it's had that, they're due every 15,000 all yearly, so 15,000 service has been done there. Then it got done at 37,000 there. And then again at 40,000 just here. So has just been serviced. It's not due until 55,000 kilometers. So you got another 10,000 kilometers without needing another service. Um, so that'll basically do my virtual tour. Um, another little feature, you can uh, obviously open the doors. The door handle's just in there. Sorry, I just haven't turned the car off properly in there. All right easy done now if you do have any questions or if i have missed anything um please let me know as i'd love to help you out on the forward ranger but looks absolutely amazing and i hope you have enjoyed my virtual tour thanks guys cheers